I mean, there are a lot of um, ways to define collaboration. So um, uh, this is a collaboration that is unusual because it does operate at that intersection. Um, uh, and it's and it's unusual in that it's it's potentially so large is that a postcard ordinarily has a recipient. So it's writing that connects person to person, people to people. It it positions you as a node on a network that can be as large as you'd like. And fundamentally, we have said that writing is about relationships, and much more about relationships between people than about reading and writing. And that's basically what a postcard does. And so it brings into relationship um, people and their writing and their histories and their relationship with others. And this is something that matters to people. So I think that's why this kind of collaboration, which will have to be shaped, I think, in some ways as we go forward, um, has so much potential. Uh, when I studied abroad, I definitely, every time I went anywhere, I would buy postcards just because it felt like that was the easiest thing to do. Uh -huh. So I have all these postcards, and so, I mean, that's really the only, only connection I have with them. Yeah. Um, and I think it's really interesting to see also the cards from, like, the early 1900s to the ones we have of the earlier ones and how the postcard has progressed. Mm -hmm. um, and I think that's, like, it's just astounding to see it. Yeah. Um, and, like, the characteristics that have remained the same, but then how society has shaped it. Um, to like the postcard being what we want it to be today. Mm -hmm. So the writing, uh, the ones that I have, um, I had one the other day that I put in, and it was from Seattle, and it was of a, a Native American uh, princess, and she was, uh, her name was uh, Angeline, and her her father was like Chief Seattle, and the writing that was on there, it was uh, it was it was beautiful, and like we don't speak the way anymore, and we don't write that way anymore. And how she like addressed this person named Elizabeth, like I felt like I was a part of their correspondence, and it was so intimate. And like the things that she would say, she's like, "We're in Seattle. We didn't see any Indians, but this is supposed to be, you know, this chief's princess." And you know, it, just, it was really interesting. Uh, I mean, to me, postcards were always sort of just you know, you go on vacation and you send someone a postcard, which is exactly what I did when I went abroad and uh -huh. I just sent people, I sent yeah. my parents postcards and they were like, oh, that's so cute. And yeah, that's right. <laughs> but then, like, I see, and a lot of the things I've seen where the cards that are written on, they just, that's sort of what people use them for, is to say, I went, I went to Rome and I saw the thing that's on this card and yes. it was really cool and how are you doing? Like, mm -hmm. that's, mm -hmm. but some of them are really interesting. Like, I, I came across one that was like, it was, I think it was one of the monument cards in somewhere in New York and... I think it was a lady who had written on it. Sometimes it's hard to tell with all the cursive. But um, she said something like, um, I'm so bored up here. There's there's no, like, all the boys are too young. Come see me. Or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh. <laughs> I wonder what's going on there. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. so, yeah. I definitely, I think postcards, I think they are definitely can be used more for more than just, you know, the, the tourist thing, because there's a lot that just aren't even written on, so people just yeah. like them, they mm -hmm. just collect them, which mm -hmm. I can understand, because a lot of them are really cool. And then, even just for people who might be interested in postcards, because, you know, some people, I mean, like the, like Don Smith, the guy we're buying them from, is, you know, has all these postcards, and it's because he, you know, yeah. likes looking at them, and, uh -huh. you know, yeah. collecting them, so yeah. that's... Yeah.